Welcome back everybody, my name is Alexson and this is the return of the Minecraft Survival Let's Play on the channel. Now this is going to be a fresh start. Oh sweet, we got a temple already. Okay, cool. Alright, so I guess today we're probably, if anything, we're just going to loot around, check out this desert. But uh, I'll also leave the seed in the next episode. The goal is if we can reach 100 likes for today's episode, I will release the seed in the next episode so all of you guys can follow along on this amazing journey. Now, for many of you guys who may be asking, uh, of course I've done multiple Minecraft Survival Let's Play place in the past but they've never really continued past like 20 episodes and you guys may be asking is this going to be the same old same old oh what? oh my god that's a village right there all right crazy all right cool so i will definitely leave this seed in the next episode we got actually a pretty good spawn right here all right sweet is that is that another temple down? Oh, that's part of the village all right cool so we're gonna just loot everything out and uh we're, we're gonna do that and then eventually we're gonna find a location for where we want to continue this series but like i mentioned we've done uh, plenty of Minecraft Survival Let's Plays, and what this is going to be different is this is going to continue for a very long time. Now, I'm going to make sure that I, I just do everything I possibly can in this world, and for the most part, just improve my building. Uh, that's I think that's the best way of saying everything is I really need to improve my building. I really am not the best builder. I kind of like can do some nice, amazing buildings here and there, but those are all by accident for the most part. So, uh, I want to make it where you know I can strive for the best. So, that's what we're going to do. But, uh, you know what? I'm not going to jump in here yet. I think it's a good idea to actually get some blocks and some, uh, maybe go punch a tree. I think that's probably the safest route for this right now. Uh, so let's go get a tree around here that's that's close enough that we can just punch and get ourselves our first achievement. And we do need some food as well. So, uh, sheep, you're gonna be the victim. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, sheep. There we go. Thank you for your donation. I'm sorry you had to see that, buddy, but, uh... Uh, I, I need some food. I'm a fox. I gotta get some food. There we go. And by the way, I'm definitely gonna be in the comment sections looking for plenty of ideas. Now, how this series is gonna work is really it's gonna be driven by a lot of you guys and, you know, ideas that you guys have may, may have in common uh, or just left in the uh, comment sections. All of those are just going to go towards, you know, making this series just that much better. But of course, I'm going to be trying to stick to a theme uh, for this Survival Let's Play. Uh, I don't yet know what that theme is going to be, but I'll let you guys know. We'll see how our building uh, goes and kind of what type of uh, style we want to go for in this uh, Survival Let's Play world. But I'm really excited because, honestly, I've always liked doing Survival Let's Plays. They've always been something I could just relax and just uh, kind of just you know, record, which I really love doing this for some reason. It just, it's always something funny because I always start them in the summer too. And if you guys don't know, I am on spring break right now, or spring break, summer break. And uh, I'm really looking forward to uh, just kind of enjoying the series and taking it as far as possible. Now, this is actually a really nice spawn. I'm really liking this spawn a lot. But uh, I just want to get as much as wood as possible before we go on this adventure. I've actually started, if you guys don't know, there's been like a recent trend in most of my worlds. Whenever I start a survival let's play, I usually get like a good spawn. Like I get villages around me. So I'm really uh, hitting the luck again for this, I think, third time or fourth time of starting a survival let's play. And, I, and I'm not proud of that. I really am not proud of that. I wish I just stuck with one and I continued it, but it's just been me getting lazy, I think. I think it's best to say it's best to start fresh uh, and get ready to go uh, with this summer because I'm really excited to get this series on the way and alright so let's make ourselves some tools let's get like some basic uh, gear that we're gonna need for this adventure here first of all I gotta I get gotta get some more food I'm sorry sheep uh, we're just gonna have to take this from you guys alright there we go thank you for your donations I am really hungry sorry about that <laughs> alright so let's eat up a little bit more I know we're gonna eat the food raw we don't have any stone yet we're gonna probably get that eventually we're just a really big noob right now because we're just starting off so uh what i really want to do right now like i mentioned was kind of just go and explore the the sand biome uh the desert biome because it looks like it has a really cool uh like a lot of villages and temples there and we could just technically get all those supplies and then eventually um move on forward and find our our desired location for this series and i think we're gonna find that today after i go and do some looting and uh we're gonna go find an area if not we're just gonna build a small little shelter and then we'll figure that out in the next episode but let's do this guys Whew, that was close all right we're gonna just have to jump down but first let me get some more blocks all right we're gonna jump down here and hope for the best please don't hit the pressure plate all right we're good let's just break this so we don't have to die <laughs> so let's check this out uh let's eat up a little bit more food actually there could be food in here so let's not waste anything oh snap all right so we got uh a lot of emeralds some sand and then gunpowder i'm not gonna take the rotten flesh uh but that's not bad already let's see what it is all right diamonds and a saddle okay 
I'm liking this. More gunpowder. I'll take that. I'll take the bone meal, too. That's going to be helpful. Uh, another emerald. Oh, snap. We got two books. Blast protection, too. What else do we have here? And flame. All right, sweet. So this is actually going to be pretty helpful for us uh, for any enchants that we plan to do in the future. What else do we have here? Another saddle. Okay, I'll take that. We have plenty of now, uh, plenty of saddles, which is actually good. Two saddles is way more than enough for me for my server Let's Plays, unless we want to make a big uh, a stable with a lot of animals. And then we check this out. All right. I think we should grab the TNT, maybe, uh, for any possible <laughs> excavations that we plan to do. <laughs> any type of uh, blowing up we plan to do in the future. We'll see what we do. But, uh, all right, that should be more than enough right there. All right, let's go check out that village, see what that village has in plans for us. Hopefully something good. All right, pretty sure we came from this spot. Oh, it's the other side. Okay, cool. Just pillar across, and bam. I hear lava around here. Oh, there it is. Okay, so let's, uh, I don't have any stone on me. We should actually probably cook our food uh, instead of just eating this raw. So let's see if there's any stone nearby. Oh, jeez, there's a creeper. Okay, all right, we almost, hey, creeper, how's it going, buddy? Nice to see you. This is our first creeper of the series, and hopefully we start off with a with a kill, not a dying here. Hopefully we don't die from him. All right, our wooden sword isn't really doing the trick. This is going to take a long time. All right. All right, buddy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We're just going to have to... There we go. All righty. So let's quickly grab ourselves some stone. Ooh, this looks... Oh, it's a small cave. Okay. I was at, for a second, I thought I was like leading into something bigger, but it's okay. We're going to get some stone, make ourselves a furnace, and I think it's safe to say we're still going to go and explore and uh, eventually build ourselves a starter home. I usually start uh, building a starter home right off the bat. Oh my gosh, okay. I usually start building a starter home uh, right when we start our series, but I think today it's, it's, it's safe enough to go and say, you know what, let's go explore because we have a pretty good spawn. So let's quickly make a furnace. We have our crafting table. Bam, we got some food. Look at this. And we got a little rabbit here. How, how's it going, rabbit? Okay, okay, he's afraid of me. I think he's afraid because I just destroyed that creeper with like 25, 25 hits. So don't be worried. I'm not too too good with a wooden sword. We're good. We're safe. All right, we need a little bit more, and we're off to go. Let's actually start eating up now. And if anything, the village does have plenty of crops that we're going to sadly have to take from them because, I mean, they do replant all their crops, but we're going to have to take all of that stuff because, uh, yeah, I'm going to need plenty of food to start off. So, all right, we got everything we need. Bam. Uh, I almost feel like deserts, uh, desert biomes actually have more villages, temples, just a lot more loots than if you were to go into a random biome. So that's just me. Uh, I could be completely wrong, but uh, let me know what you guys think of the comment sections. But I always seem to find plenty of luck around here. Now, we got to make sure... Oh, yes, there's a blacksmith. Okay, cool. And we have plenty of food, too. Looks like it's turning night, so uh, we're actually going to make a, a bed real quick and uh, get some rest so we don't die by any mobs. All right, let's just quickly craft ourselves a bed. We're going to go in the blacksmith. This should be... Okay, perfect. Um, let's put our crafting table right about here. Make ourselves at home. <laughs> All right. Don't worry. Don't worry, villagers. We're just making ourselves at home right now, okay? All right, let's just get let's get a bed, and let's go to get some sleep. All right, we're just going to put the bed right there. Perfect. Nice. All right, I'm happy. We got plenty of achievements, too, which is awesome. Just what we need to start off with. All right, let's check out this chest. Oh, yeah, there we go. All right, we just got a big upgrade in weapons and everything. We got food. We got all the food we need. Ah, sweet. Okay, so our weapons just had a big upgrade. Helmet, looking good so far. And I think we're going to just, uh, we're going to take the chest as well. Why not? Just in case we need to place it. And uh, we'll leave the bed for now, I think. Actually, we'll take it with us because if it turns night again, we're going to need to get some rest once more. But I'm pretty sure everything else here is there's nothing more besides maybe books. What do you have for trade? Nothing. Nothing too important. There we go. We got to get some books. So let's do that. Let's just put our sand. Bam. Let's just grab all these books here and because this is going to be good for making our enchantment table in the future. So let's snatch some of this. We're just pretty much being looters in this episode of, of the Minecraft Survival Let's Play. We're looting everything we can in this uh, desert biome. Which is, which is not too bad. Alright, I'm going to keep looking around. We're going to have to get tons of your food, villagers. Hopefully hopefully you guys don't mind. Alright, let's get to this part here. We're going to have to, we're gonna have to build a cross. There we go. Alright, some crops. That's what I'm talking about. You know what, we're going to just take everything. Because we're going to make a big farm eventually as well. But I'll leave a little bit just for the villagers so they can recrop as well. But uh, we're going to take some of these because there's seeds as well, which we need. Bam. All right. Let's keep going. Let's go. Let's go a bit more north and see if we could find anything else. Uh, there's another little farm up there that we might take some stuff from. Uh, but I think we're okay right now. I think we have plenty of food. Oh, you know what? There's the beets. All right. 
We got ourselves. This is beetroot, I'm pretty sure it's called. Yeah, beetroot seeds. All right, we'll take some of this. We're kind of getting full inventory. We're going to throw that out. And then we could just throw out anything else we don't need. Uh, let's see. We'll throw out that cobble. We don't need it. There we go. All right, see you guys. Thanks for your supplies. Sorry about uh, kind of destroying some of your crops there. <laughs> All right, let's keep looking around and see if we can find... Oh, my God. Is that another temple over there? I swear... That is another temple. It Look at in the far distance, everybody. Oh, snap. All right, let's go see if we can find anything useful there as well. And uh, this is actually turning to be a really good start. I mean, we have a full inventory of, of resources that we've just been looting from. So that's kind of crazy. I think this is my best ever spawn for the amount of loot I've gotten. So I'm pretty happy about that. That's pretty good. All right, let's just dig on in. All righty. Sweet. All right, looks pretty safe. No creepers. Okay, we're good. Sweet. Sometimes they actually are in here just ready to pounce on you. All right. Bam. Perfect. And, oh, snap. We got diamonds and horse armor. All right. Now we're making progress. I'm liking this. Uh, let's throw away what we don't need. I think we can get rid of that axe and our sword weapon. Or our uh, wooden sword as its sword weapon. Wow. Good, good, good job, Alexton. All right. And uh, we'll definitely take this horse armor. Let's see what else we got here. Another book of thorns. Okay. We're going to keep the bone meal. Uh, it's good for any of our crops that we're going to be making. Tons of gold. And another book. Oh, aqua. Okay, sweet. This is going to be great for our enchants. All right, we could just leave the, the wool in there. And last but not least, two golden apples. Guys, this is actually a really fantastic seed. I'm definitely going to be leaving it uh, for you all in the next episode. So again, just hit that like button. Let's go see if we can hit at least uh, 100 likes. If we could do that, then I will make sure to release the seed. And even if we don't, I'll still make sure to release it in the second episode. Let's grab ourselves some more TNT. Now, the reason why I'm grabbing more TNT is one... I could still possibly use it for any excavations we plan to do. So if we have any mining uh, that we need to do, this will be a perfect way to just pretty much blow up a big hole and get our mine shaft going. So uh, I think that's a perfect start for any type of mining project we have uh, in plan. So I, I, we definitely will be going mining. And plus, I do plan on doing plenty of streams. Um, I want to do a lot of streams uh, for this series as well. So anytime I'm, uh, I finish the episode, I might do some uh, streams so that I can actually just kind of continue the progress and show things on screen, which I think a lot of you guys would appreciate. So we're actually going to get some cactus because we can definitely dye ourselves uh, some clay and whatever else we need. So we're going to definitely take this for a cactus farm. And how's it going, rabbits? Are you guys going to run away from me again? Okay, never mind. You guys don't want to be friends. It's all cool. It's all cool. I understand. I'm a fox, so you guys wouldn't run and stay too close to me. All right, it looks like that's the last straw of, of luck we had right there. Two temples, a village, all of which had plenty of supplies for us, and I'm pretty happy about that. Is that is that? Don't tell me that's another village in the distance. I think it It looks like it is, guys. Oh, my God. Okay, that, that might be another village in the distance. It is another village. Oh, my gosh. Guys, all right, so I'm going to try to put the coordinates as well. So all the locations I've been to, I'll try to put the coordinates so you guys can find them along. Or you can just watch this video while you look over the seed uh, or while you download the seed and kind of go and explore. But does this one have a blacksmith? It doesn't look like it does. All right, not a big deal. I mean, we took what we can. We could just take, take those books over there, the bookshelves. Probably take a bit more crops. How's it going, rabbits? <laughs> They're all afraid of me. I don't know why. Um, all right. Hey, guys. Uh, I know. I know. You are you heard about the other villages. I know. A fox is coming through and destroying things. Trust me. That's not me. That's just not me. That's not who I am. All right. Just going to take this. Yeah, that's not me. Don't worry, guys. Just uh, just going through. Taking whatever I can. <laughs> all right. So we're not really doing too much harm to these villagers. If anything, we're just being a villager like them. We're just gathering our supplies, surviving, doing what, what villagers will usually do. But we don't really trade often. What do you guys have? Anything useful? Ooh, not really. I'm just going to have to snatch those books from you guys. You guys have a great library here. You know, don't mind me. Just going to have to take a few. Don't worry, I'll return them. When I'm done with my use, when I read them all, I'll, I'll return them. We're good. <laughs> all right, let's keep gathering all of this stuff. We have tons of supplies, guys. I think it's it's safe to say we can probably go and uh, find ourselves a location that we can settle down in. All right. But we do have three diamonds, so we can make a diamond pickaxe or a diamond sword. Or we can save up for any enchants. So I'm thinking it's safe to say uh, we're going to decide that in the next episode. So anything I have on me that's valuable right now, like for example the diamonds, what should I do with those? Those are really the only thing I can craft with right now. So I would like to know what I should do with those three diamonds. Should it be a sword? Should we save up? Should we make a diamond pickaxe? 
Uh, let me know what you guys think is best. I feel like a diamond pickaxe would be the best because then we can go and get uh, obsidian, make an enchantment table, and then we can craft ourselves a diamond sword with some handy dandy uh, books that we have here. So I think that's the better better go to for now. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go off and explore this world. Gonna try to find a location that we can just settle down into. And uh, after that, once we find that location, I'll build a little shack and then we'll end off today's episode. I think that's good. Um, I might just continue going in this direction. Who knows? Uh, maybe we'll bump into another village, but I doubt that we will. Oh, shoot. Everything's turning on fire here. All right, we don't want to be here. All right, so that's what we're going to do. I'm going to go look for an area. We'll be back in just a few. Two hours later. Alrighty, so I have found the prime real estate for this series. Guys, this is going to be our new home. This is going to be the area that we're going to develop this series and take it as far as possible and just really just have a fantastic time. Now, if you guys don't know, this took me about freaking, I don't know, an hour to two hours to find. I had to go from like the sand bio from the temple and just kind of headed north for such a long time. I think it was south or north, whatever it was. But if you guys can find a better location than this prime real estate, make sure to tweet me at my Twitter. It'll be down below in the description. Of course, the seed will be released in the second episode. So the challenge is in the second episode, once I release the seed, if you guys can find a better area to build, then you guys have beaten me in that challenge. But I think this is honestly one of the best areas I have found it took me about two hours and just look at this area it's absolutely wonderful you even have a jungle biome over there and you have just like nice scenery around here plenty of horses plenty of flat land and honestly I think this is the golden the golden area for this this series by the way I actually did find a few other villages and temples along the way I also have uh, their coordinates in the description as well and that's how I got some of this extra gear I got a few more diamonds just one diamond a few more apples a bit more gold some more saddles and some other books uh, the only one that's new here I believe is knockback and flame uh, we did get a few more emeralds and besides that I believe everything else is the same a few more iron and uh, I think that's everything else that's pretty much the same and yeah so it's been quite a journey we got here now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go and actually start building our small little shack and we're gonna finally settle down and get ourselves the supplies we need to get and build this freaking shelter because we need to get the shelter done ASAP. All right, so we got to place this. Uh, all right, let's just place this. All righty, and let's get ourselves. Oh my gosh, we don't even have any wood. I dropped all of it. All right, this is crazy. Okay, so let's get some more. Here we go. Let's get as much of this as possible. And then uh, we're going to build ourselves a basic axe from our iron. And I think it's the best choice. I was talking about this earlier. But I think the best way to go about this is to use those uh, diamonds for, uh, for example, building a pickaxe. But we're not going to do it right now. We're not going to do it now. Uh, that's just going to be for another episode. But, oh my gosh, we have so much stuff. we got to build a chest right now. This is insane. Place this chest here. And we're just going to kind of just throw everything in here just so we can get some more space, clear out this inventory, and we should be good to go. All right, there we go. Let's just put all the valuables in there for now. So let's just take back the food um, and anything else and just put those valuables in there. All right, cool. Let's go get ourselves some wood right now because uh, we got to get the shelter. This is going to be a very small shelter. And uh, this is not going to be like the home I'm going to keep forever. This is just going to be a start shelter room. Uh, and then we're going to eventually uh, build our home. And I, I was thinking about this uh, as I was exploring. And I would really like, instead of having just a storage room, I would really like to have, like, specific buildings for specific items. Now, let me know what you guys think about that. So, for example, if I wanted to have a place to go put my food, I could maybe just build a farm. And I would go to that farm and I would get all the food I need from there. And then another thing could be, like, for example, armory. I could build, like, a barracks or something where there would be soldiers and, like, having, like, all my armor and gear around there. I think that would be kind of cool to do. Uh, so that would kind of build a theme around here. Instead of just having one building full of supplies that could get really unorganized very quickly so i'm thinking that's the best of both worlds again let me know what you think in the comment sections and any other ideas that you may have would be absolutely amazing just to hear what you guys have to say uh but yeah how hyped are you guys let me know again in the comment sections for this series honestly i'm gonna try to upload this on a daily basis so daily videos of the survival let's play um and also i'm going to stream when i can stream so those are the goals right there any of the streams are gonna be like a grind stream so pretty much streams that are gonna have to do like a lot of building a lot of uh you know mining a lot of other type of things that you guys might not want to see 
on uh, episodes. So I think it's, a, it's the best of both worlds. And honestly, you guys have been showing a lot of support on the streams. And the streams will be on YouTube Gaming. I think it's safe to say, instead of moving all of these items across there, this is going to be the area where we're going to build most of our thing. Like, most of our homes, most of our structures. It's going to be across this river. We're going to have bridges going across here. It's going to look absolutely fantastic. But in the meantime, we're just going to build our little shack right here. I think it's a nice view. Kind of a perfect area. Let's just take down this tree as well. And we might keep it there forever just for a historical moment you know the first the first home we ever built oh my gosh we could have fallen to our death right there you know what i think we should cover this up because knowing me i might fall to my death <laughs> by the end of the episode if i if i keep keep walking over that so let's take down this tree as well kind of clear up the area uh, and this is going to be a bit of a longer episode because it's the first episode so that's kind of just my goal here but all right let's get this going let's get some of this iron Get some shears so we can take these leaves down much quicker. All right, let's chop these guys down. Perfect. And I'm going to use a lot of these leaves for uh, designs too. And by the way, if you guys are going to be playing on this world as I, when I release the seed, please send me any screenshots of any builds you did on your t uh, to my Twitter. Honestly, it would be absolutely amazing just to see you guys uh, you know, joining along with this series. It would be absolutely awesome just to see how active you guys are with this series in, in general. Oh, no, it's raining. All right, whatever. No big deal. We'll just have to keep going along. Why can I not pick these up? Oh, there we go. I was, like, going to say for a second. It looks like it was lagging, but this is not even a server, so I don't know why. <laughs> yeah, you can. I think you can. Ah, oh, sweet. Okay, perfect. So the rain might go away, which would be pretty nice. There we go. Please go away, rain. I don't want you here no more. All right. Oh, shoot. We got a first zombie on video. You guys were a pain when I was traveling. You have no idea. Oh, gosh. Here we go. All right. There we go. We're good. But, uh, yeah, they were absolutely annoying all the mobs when I was trying to build. So we're going to build a small shack. So it's going to be very small, nothing fancy, because that's not what this is all about. It's going to be very compact, uh, and that's how we're going to keep it, because it's our first little shelter, just to stay away from any mobs that may come across us. And we can make ourselves our shovel. Bam, first shovel, I think, ever, so that's cool. All right, let's just put the flooring in. We're just going to make it some wood flooring, keep it really simple. There we go. Even with the insides here. Alright. Making progress. I'm happy. And uh, if anything, we can actually make it into birch wood. How about that? We'll make it birch wood. I think that'll look okay. Because we're going to use the outside structure. Pretty much it's just going to be oak wood. And it's going to be a very simple build. Now this build is going to look pretty ugly. Because it's not my real build. You know what I mean? This is not how I'm going to build on the rest of the series. Trust me. It's going to look much better than what this is. So no fear. You guys will be fine. Don't worry. All right. Uh, let's use the oak wood. There we go. Very simple structure. Probably one of the most simple structures I'm ever going to build on this uh, series. So I guess we can enjoy this moment. <laughs> All right. Very simple. We're just going to have one door. I think it's safe to say, oh, we need some more uh, stone. I, where's the stone that I use here? I might have to take this stone. Maybe. I put it somewhere here for, for the safety reasons of not falling down to our death. Uh, it should be somewhere around here. Come on now. There it is. All right. We're just going to snatch some of this. Obviously, we don't want to fall. There's a creeper over there too. Okay. Uh, all right. Sweet. We're not going to try to die here. I'm just going to go down, do a little bit of some simple mining. <laughs> Hopefully, we don't die to our death here. That would be really sad. All right. Cool. We just need a little bit just for the design of this house. Perfect. That's all I need. Now we can just leave this place and never fall down again over there. All right. Uh, there we go. We just need a cobble. Uh, we'll put cobble over there too. Maybe a window here would be nice. Just one small little window. And we'll finish it off like this with a door here. Guys, we're making progress. This is a beautiful little house. All right. Bam. I think it actually should go from the inside the door. I know that some of you guys like it to be like that, but I really think this looks just better, in my opinion. So, uh, we're just gonna stick with this. Obviously, you guys might be... No, I don't know. I don't know. It adds a bit of detail, but whatever. We're just not gonna worry about it. And now we're just gonna quickly make some stairs. Some basic stairs, uh, which are gonna go as the roof. And it's just gonna go around here. It's gonna be a very small looking house, but I think it's gonna be nice. So, we'll just go around here. And it's just gonna go all the way around. Like so. And then, uh, I don't know how, if you guys may be wondering how long I'm going to stay in this house, it's probably not going to be for too long. It's just going to be enough for me to gather my supplies and then eventually build, like I said, the kind of structures that are going to go along in this world. And once that starts, it's going to be a smoother ride for us. All right, so let's just convert most of these here just so we can make some more stairs. Bam. All right, cool. And that should be enough. 41 should be plenty for us 
to go around and finish this project up. Let's use some of the dirt to pillar up. There we go. And look at this little thing. This is turning into a really cool little shack. Honestly, it's probably one of the nicest shacks I've built. Uh, considering I've done a few in the past and, you know, they're not as, as beautiful as this one. So, yeah, not too bad, not too bad. It is small, though, but that's the goal of it, just to keep it small. And we're going to make it really compact. <laughs> so it's going to look kind of interesting when it's done. All right, let's just finish it up. This should be the final touch right here, this little roof. I swear I just saw a spider somewhere around here. No, we're good. All right, we're good. Man, I really love this view from here. We could eventually build some other stuff on this side of the island if anything it's not really an island but this side of the, the the land i guess across the river but look at this guys it's a little house it's perfect it does the job i believe we have some sand that we can uh make ourselves into some glass here uh we need some more actually and let's just snatch some while we're here anyways let's make ourselves a small window just a small window and end off today's episode Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Honestly, I think it was pretty fun today. We found a lot of cool supplies. We definitely did a lot of scavenging because I've never started off uh, a survival let's play this stacked. It's it's crazy. So I'm really happy with that. And by the way, we should actually put ourselves the items inside the house. So let's build a chest and let's make this as compact as possible. I really hope there's enough room. I really hope there is. So should be enough. Bam. All right. Just one chest. So that we can actually, let's do a double chest. That way, actually, a double chest won't work in here. But we'll just kind of like put it up here in the, in the top. I think that could be kind of cool. Uh, so we'll just put one right there and one right there. Oh, that's actually kind of cool. I like that. All right. So now we just need the bed. Did I destroy the bed? There it is. All right. And we could just place it something like that if we can get it. There we go. Guys, look at this little place. This is looking pretty nice. I'm actually quite happy with this. Of course, I'm going to do some little other details, but for now, I think this is the perfect place for us with a little glass window, and I'm thinking you guys might not like this door like this, but whatever. We're just going to deal with it for now, but uh, I'm pretty happy about it. Let's actually close this up again so I don't fall to my death. Perfect. There we go. Close it up. Bam. Looks like nothing was ever there. But guys, I'm pretty happy with this. Obviously, the window looks very weird. But for now, check this out. It's just what we need. A little bit of a view. Get, get some rest. Kind of do our supplies. Uh, which reminds me we should throw everything in here right now. So we can just move our stuff. And yeah, I'm going to move this stuff into this uh, little shack we have. And we're going to call it an episode, guys. If you enjoyed today's episode, make sure you hit that like button for more Minecraft Summer Let's Play. As I mentioned, this is going to be a daily upload series. I'm also going to stream it when I have the chance. Uh, whenever I'm going to do some like big projects. So... If you guys are excited for that, don't forget to hit the like button. Subscribe if you guys are new as well. I'll see you guys next time with another Minecraft Survival Let's Play. Peace out, guys, and stay foxy.